better get your sports straight. You better get you better get your sports straight. Look it up. Google it, fool. Google it. Welcome back to a new video. We are out here today. Don't hate the player, hate the game. Yo, don't hate the player, hate the game. What are we doing? Fixing HGTV's finest. I want to take that top. I want to take that off. Why? I think you should leave it on. That? This side? Yeah, I don't like it. Yeah, because it'll make a wall for this one. You think? Yeah, and then you could paint on it or something. But the... Put this side in. I know, but the things on the outside look so like a, they're fence. It's fine. It'll complete this and then you could like paint on it. You could paint it. Oh, I have all the tools. I found a hammer in that. too hard to get them straight because there's things in the way. That's why they're crooked. <laughs> yeah, that's what it sounds like. Or somebody left their uh, phone off the hook. That's it. <laughs> or the busy tone. Like yeah. when you call the landlines back in the day. Remember, you could hear somebody clip over there.
if you don't try to do it, uh, it's not going to happen. So just try to do it and see what happens. And I'm not going to fake it until I make it because I feel I already made it. And I would never let anybody else do this other than myself. Same with like building a house. My grandpa helped me build the house. I wouldn't never hire a contractor to do work that I know that I can do myself. And this this fence is unique. Live outside the box. And first, when when you build a house, here's something to take in, in consideration. If you're building an old house that needs a new roof, you start by putting a new roof on the house first. Because then, when you start doing the work inside the house, if the roof is leaking, it's just gonna ruin the work that you are doing inside the house. If, if you got a leaky roof, and you're putting new drywall, making it all look nice, and doing all the things that you're supposed to do to make the house look nice, and then you don't put a new roof on, but you finish the inside of the house and you put a roof on last, that's half-assed backwards thinking. And if I had a four-story house, upstairs, downstairs, attic, and a basement, so that's four stories. I would start from the top and work my way down and not act like a crazy mad person and just go from room to room and starting on the outside and then going on the inside and then going back on the outside. I would start from the inside and work my way out from the outside. If you wanna get real technical with it, I would start in the summertime, do the roof, and if it needs new siding on the house, do the do the outside, and then do the inside when it's winter time. It would probably take me one year to build a house, to remodel a house from top to bottom, because I'm a savage and I'd be there working almost every day. That's what we did with this house. Yeah, it took a while because my grandpa was was older at the time, but we got it done. We did it ourselves. So whatever Foot Locker you walked into from the night from the early '80s to the early '90s to the early 2000s from all the way from Buffalo, New York, all the way to Seattle, to Canada, and you worked in a Foot Locker. If you worked in a Foot Locker or walked into a Foot Locker, my grandpa probably put his hands on whatever you walked into, built it. So I come from a long background of men knowing what to do and getting shit done. All right, we got the fence done. The only thing that's different about this side and this side is that I had to cut these to make it go up here and there's a big hole right here so I have to find something to bring down to cover that space but other than that it looks good it's super I don't know it's more privacy it's more it's rustic looking it's privacy it's what else you barbecue out here chill out here and now when cars cars do drive by and around 4:30, 5 o'clock in the afternoon, that's when the traffic comes. Because they try to think they can beat the light up there. When in reality, well, well, maybe sometimes, but sometimes it's just faster to wait in the line of traffic than it is to come down here and try to. Because you have to sit and wait for all the lights. So there's a lot of traffic that comes down here at like 4:30, 5 o'clock. Sometimes we're out here at 4:30, 5 o'clock, and now we have peace and. Not peace and quiet, but more, more peace, more privacy. Now, the other issue that we have here is the pa the patio. It's all grimy looking. Shout out to my dad for buying me this pressure washer to pressure wash screens for screen printing. And that's the reason why I'm doing all this right now. So when it becomes summertime, May, June, July, until about my birthday, October. The only thing that I'm concentrating on, skateboarding, t-shirts, sweatshirts, stickers, and filming videos. And doing other things too, like mowing the lawn and stuff like that. But I don't wanna be doing all this pressure washing and getting the house ready throughout the whole entire summer. I'd rather do it right now when it's spring to where I have the whole summer to do whatever I want. And the only thing I have to worry about is mowing the lawn. I was using the stock hose and handle. It's just not powerful enough to get this stuff off. So I found this old hose with this old handle and it 
butts right up to where it used to be. And this one is the old one that I used to screen print with. Not screen print, but clean the screens with. And it started burning, not burning holes through the screen, but blowing holes through the screens. So I know for a fact it's gonna blow off this stuff. This one right here just has stock settings. I don't even know what the right word is, but there's not that many settings. There's only like, you can only flare it out and put it this way and it shoots out like a stream. So it's not, the pressure washer's power enough, but there's no other settings to get this off. I don't want to be out here for hours doing this. I want to be out here maybe 15, 20 minutes and get it done because it's really not that big of an area.